Last time on Ghost of Tsushima. Okay, grab the controller. And walk up to the bamboo. R2. Easy. It's too late. <gasps> what? That's crazy. You're not done yet, Hachan. What? Right, go. Up for it. No, 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 you're still there. Hachan, you're too keen. Go to the entrance of the hot spring. I miss hot spring. Get out of the hot spring. I don't want to. I want to swim in here. Find the entrance of the hot spring. Try not to jump inside. Is this the one? Yep. Jiggy's a girl, so she likes this. Touch, 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 touch. I've seen this before, you made me watch this. Okay, no, 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 no. Put it back on. I mean, her tail. Let's do her tail. They're not very long. And we found her, which means we should be able to chain all the other ones. There's no reason why we can't chain them. You know what happened. Tell me. We don't know anything. I want answers. How dare you threaten us? They've even got a banjo. Oh. We kind of deserve that. <laughs> Twelve hour stream? Ha! Huh. I wish I could, but I've got work tomorrow. I work nine to five. I'm a wage slave for now. Jin, over here, quickly. Nani? Masako. How long have you been here? Not long enough. You need some rest. What I need is justice for my family's murder. I'll be one step closer once I catch the snake named Umara. One of the conspirators on the list. He supplied the weapons that butchered my family. And we will find him and make him talk. He must be in the town. The fool. Why do I feel like we are the fool? Damn it, it didn't screenshot when I wanted it to. We need to get out of the open. This way. Omada's rumored to be traveling to Umugi. I just don't know when, so I've been camping out, waiting. We can keep watch from here. Do you know what Omada looks like? I'm not sure. I haven't seen him in 20 years. You knew him? He supplied our clan, but he cheated us. Then tried to blame my husband for not paying him enough. Was he right? Of course not. Now please, watch the road and get comfortable. We might be here a while. <laughs> Three days later. Masako, there. Men on the walkway. They look just like him. Exactly like Omana 20 years ago. They must be his sons. Were they both involved? I don't know. Who cares? Revenge and all that. Let's follow them. I'm taking the canyon. There are people I need to speak with. People you need to boast to. Excuse me? <sighs> Never mind. I'll see you in a movie. They're splitting up. Let's follow them. See what we can learn. I'll take the left. You take the right. The canyon is narrow. Stay high to avoid being seen. 
We don't know if it has anything to do with the Mongolians, but her family was murdered by another clan. Mm, ungrateful little rat. Too high and mighty to help me do the dirty work. But when I'm rich, no doubt he'll help me spend the money. Wait, I was supposed to take the high ground? Whoops. It still shocks you that the lady that plays Lady Massacre played Julie in Friends? I've never seen Friends. Like how he just talks to himself. Father, I've avenged our family. Old Adachi is dead. Avenged? Clan too. <laughs> Kipe says what I did is shameful. But he doesn't remember what Adachi did to us, to you. <laughs> what did they By do? Morning, I'll have enough money to make up for what they took from you a thousand times over. What did they take? What the hell happened? So the father's dead. Father's proud of me. Why wouldn't he be? Something's not adding up. No, my feet will never be dry. First thing I'll do when I'm rich is put in some decent robes. Oh, that's how you won't stay rich for long. Okay, I'm in the town, so he's less likely to notice me sneaking because need a drink. town. Who's there? Come in here. I stole those pickled onions ages ago. I'm calling my brother. No need. I'm leaving. What does he expect? This is Umugi. I should find Masako. You cannot win, for I always have the high ground. My god, she's Batman! Jin, over here. The one I followed was in Bolt. He spoke of revenge against Clan Adachi. Then what are we waiting for? He's on his way to meet the man who hired him. The man who ordered my family murdered. Let's get closer. Hear what they're saying. Wow, Masako. now we're spies. Is it just me, or does all of Jin's friend behave like a ninja? Like, this type of sneaking isn't very samurai. I want out. You're just getting cold feet. It's not right. What a dachi did to father isn't right. Our family ending up in the street. Father's drinking. He stole from Adachi. And father was always a drunk. Listen, we pull this off, and you can use the money to escape. Take your family and leave the Mongols behind. Let's get this over with. Hmm. They're leaving. Let's follow. Keep low or they might see us. Where are they leaving? We gotta go this way. So he will be at the beach? That's where I told him to meet us. Old lady, what's the worst she can do? I should gut him where he stands. Not yet. <sighs> oh, 
Oh my god, they're using fire next to flammable shit. They're about to get killed. These fools are walking into a trap. Let's wait. See what happens. Something's not right. Let me do the talking. I hope we haven't kept you waiting. Which one of you is Omura? That would be me. You have the payment? We do. No! Omura's mine! Well, that was late. Talking about a letter, he might still have it on him. You are to meet a man named Omura in Umugi Cove. He means to blackmail me, kill him. I'm moving funds from Kushi and will pay you upon successful completion. I'll look. I'll check the bandits, see if they're holding anything. Son of bitch, man, we should have saved them earlier and then interrogated them. This note bears the same clan emblem that was on the list from the inn. There is no need for threats. I will gladly bring payment to Mugi in exchange for your silence. Until then, know your discretion is appreciated that you will be generously compensated. Huh. This was a setup. Whoever killed your family, lured Omura here to silence him. A coward is covering his tracks. Judging by this note, it's clear he's desperate for money. He must not lead a wealthy clan. Oh, he has no clan at all. You think my family's killer isn't a samurai? Maybe he wants to become one. Start his own clan. And he's scavenging the corpse of Clan Arachi to fund it. Few people have the ambition for such a plot. I can use this. Narrow my search. First, get some rest. This hunt is killing you. Until I find the man responsible. There is no rest. She's gonna die of- You can't hide from me forever. I mean, if you don't sleep for three and a half days, you start hallucinating. Yep, we were the fool. Damn it, the screenshot isn't working when I want it to. Son of a bitch. Oh, at least we're here where the item is. I think. when you're the only samurai left alive you have to be flexible <laughs> but here's the best part a friend of mine met this merchant in umugi cove good place to hide your sake from the invaders he told my friend that the ghost was going to grant him samurai status for his heroism <laughs> make a sake merchant a samurai ridiculous the sake samurai <laughs> it's got a nice ring to it All right, where is she? Please tell me she's somewhere on the goddamn map. I don't want to have to find her again. She's a hard one to find. Seriously? Oh my god, why does she hide? Oh, there she is. Lady Masako's list of conspirators grows thin, but the person who organized the attack on Clan Adachi has yet to be found. Masako has gone to Otsuna. Perhaps she has new information. I was gonna say, if I have to find her again... Like, she's playing hiding and seek, I'm telling you that. Speaking of sleep, I feel like napping on the floor for a bit because I accidentally stayed up all night to make sure I didn't miss the stream. And now I'm dying. Oh my god, you need to learn how to set your alarm. Get some... Um, it's called... I'll tell you what the alarm is called on the phone. It forces you to do puzzles or math equations. It's called Alarm Clock. Alarm Clock Extreme. Spelt with an X. I said it to have to do math equations when I Where's wake up. Juji? Lady Masako! Speak, monk! Please stop! Where is Junjin? Masako! 
What are you doing? Helping this monk find his tongue. My lord! Help! Masako, let me handle this. Fine. But if you can't make him talk, I will. Oh, uh, trust me, by the time you have to do math puzzles, you'll be awake. I thought she was going to kill me. No harm will come to you. What do you know about Junshin? Junshin was helping survivors at Red Leaf Temple. But I hear the Mongols raided it. Then he's in danger. We will find him. Oh, I hate math, but I find myself being able to solve them quicker and quicker. Oh my god, look what at that field. With Junshin? He conspired to kill my family. He's been saving refugees. And his name wasn't on the list we found. Someone left him a note at the temple. It's identical to the ones the conspirators carried. Junshin was promised supplies for his relief camps. In return, he was to provide information on my whereabouts. It's just an offer. This proves nothing. It proves he had contact with the person who killed my family. We will get to the bottom of this by talking to Junxing. You have my word. He was last seen at Redleaf Temple. You can modify the difficulty. You can make it as difficult or as easy as you want. And it gets ridiculously difficult. Let's go. Wait for I me. Keep up. Am I wearing ghost armor or am I wearing my thingy armor? When we find the monk. Let me deal with him. Remember, we agreed to talk to him. The men who killed my family talked with their swords. Masako, you will not kill Junshin until we're certain of his guilt. Your father was murdered. Did you talk with his killer? No. Lord Shumura tracked him down and collected his head. You've had your vengeance, Jin. Don't stand in the way of mine. I just realized that if you hold forward, he's going to follow her horse. You don't ha even have to use directions. <laughs> Mongols? XP? Dosho? Ah! Enough! Bastards! You pick that! To find Junshin this way. Okay. Well, let's have ghost mode. Why do I get the feeling that you the know what? Is close. And so is the monk. I don't think she's gonna die at the end of this. She can't die. Ooh, these guys are demons or ogre guardians. Fine, I won't kill them. Hmm? We can take them. The no, we strike quietly. Jin. Or they might kill the monk. Fine. I'll take one. You take the other. No, I'm taking both. Chain assassination. Watch. Ah! I you shit. <laughs> what the hell? She almost got me killed. Reinforcements. I need to get Junshin. What? 
the fuck? Masako! Stand aside, Jin. You betrayed my family. Ah, I had a heart attack. Run! If we fight, the Mongols win. Oh, come on! They already won. Oh, come on! Don't you do it! You were my friend. Give me the mark. No! <laughs> See, I don't want to have to use Ghost against you. Because that would not be cool. Yeah! <laughs> Oof! Damn! I'm doing this the hard way. Ooh, she's quick. I told you to give me the monk. Alright, she's gone absolutely fucking insane. Give me the mark. No. You are defending a murderer! We agreed to talk to him! Talking never works! You promised me! My promise is to my family! <laughs> Growing this up. What? I was healing! I told you to give me the monk. Seriously, I don't want to just spam my technique on you. It would be such a waste. <laughs> Damn duels. You were my friend. Give me the monk. No. <laughs> You are defending a murderer! We agreed to talk to him! Talking never works! You promised me! My promise is to my family! Hear them coming? They are the enemy. Woof. I told you to give me the monk. Seriously? You're still fighting when Mongolians on the horizon? Oh, I should have just ended this with ghost, but nope, had to do it the old fashioned way. Alright, fine, whatever. You were my friend. Give me the monk. No. You are defending a murderer! We agreed to talk to him! Talking never works! You promised me! My promise is to my family! God damn it! You shouldn't have stood in my way. I know I should block that by countering it, but I try to dodge it instead. But it's so quick because she hits you with the butt of the sword. And no one else does that in this goddamn game. You were my friend. Give 
me. Monk. No. Damn, she's quick. What the fuck? You brought this on yourself. She's so quick. She's so quick. She's one of the quickest duels ever. I like it. I like it. I like it. You were my friend. Give me. No. I can't believe that worked. What? I. You are defending a murderer. I want to try that. I was in. Did she just fucking tackle me? You brought this on yourself. She uses some more traditional stances and attacks. She does a very good men cut, but still, I suck at this. All right, I'm gonna try to do this quickly. You were my friend. Give me the mark. No. You are defending a murderer! We agreed to talk to him! Talking never works! You promised me! My promise you hear is to my coming. family! They are the enemy! She's gonna fucking die at the end of this. How did I change stances? Why did I keep going into wind stance? I never use wind stance. Water stance for the win. You gave me your word. When I looked at Junjin, all I saw were my dead grandchildren. Their faces after being cut down, and you were protecting him. So you tried to kill me? Have you lost your mind? I have lost everything! No, you've sacrificed everything for revenge. And what do you feel when you think of Juzo? We can't let anger consume us. Oh, <laughs> excuse me? Will blind us to our friends. You still trust me? Junshin won't get far. We can track him down. Masako, don't ever try to kill me again. I won't. I promise. Well, the that was tracks. something. I mean, I could have done it in Ghost, but I kind of wanted to have a proper duel. Why are you playing the flute? What are you doing?
It's worthwhile doing these types of things properly time to time. Though I won't be doing that for the Khan. Fuck the Khan. Even with ghost mode, he probably won't be enough. Way. When was the last time I meant to change stances? The Looks last like time I accidentally the went out of... We um... find Junshin. Perhaps I should speak with him first. So you don't trust me. It doesn't matter. Junshin won't. And we need him to talk. Fair point. But they... remember, Jin. He only needs his tongue to talk. Ugh. Aren't they nice to follow the path and leave tracks? That promise means a lot, gentlemen. I know, right? Two minutes later, she said her promises to her family. There he is. Please, don't kill me. Oh, boy. Who offered you supplies in exchange for information about Masako? She called herself Lady Hana. She? Maya! Masako, wait. Who the Who's fuck? Lady Hana? My sister. She was massacred with the rest of my family. She visited me two nights ago. Wore a crimson kimono with a golden sash. I remember. She smelled of chrysanthemum. No. Did you see a body? I never told her anything about you. I swear it. Leave us. Did you see a body? Did you see a body? My sister's alive. She murdered the children. That's fucked up. Why would she want to destroy your clan? I don't know. But I am going to find her. You don't have to do it alone. Meet me in Kamiyagata. So what's the deal? Did the husband have a thing for both sisters? Or was the sister jealous? Or what the hell? Because that's fucked up. I mean, even so, she was auntie to the kids. Seasons of War. Damn. I hate it when the bloody screenshot doesn't work when I want it to. Alright, where is she? Nine out of nine. Lady Masako's sister is the one behind her family's slaughter. I'll never forget how she shattered when she found out. But Masako is a warrior determined to finish what she started and bring honor to her family. After this, I may be all she has left. That's fucked up. It's time for the final mission. Man, these... These... These final missions for our um, allies are fucked up. The only one that ended remotely nicely was Tamoe. Even though her one seemed like it was going to be the worst one. And then the other ones just ended up horribly. Like, fuck. And I just wasted that. But like... <laughs> this is fucked up. These are just dark. I'm really curious to see what the reason was, but I don't know. Did she get married to a rival clan or some shit and then was jealous of it? it if, if it was something like jealousy and she slaughtered her nieces and nephews, I am gonna just... I don't know. There's not much of an excuse. I mean, even if you were in love with your sister's husband, you don't slaughter the family. I... <laughs> No matter which way you slice and dice it, it's just not good. Okay, I don't see a thing anywhere. I'm just going to teleport here. Okay, I've teleported, so she should be visible now. That's the village. Nah. It's Kushi Temple. There we go. Fort Kamino Dake. Can I port that? I can't. You would think the port would be a teleport, but no. Use the tail menu? I did, but it wasn't visible. Oh no, it wasn't visible there because... What the fuck? It wasn't visible before I did the teleport. It should have been visible now. What the hell is this? You gonna tell me something about something? 
I was trying to fix my wagon with pieces from a bamboo stand when I was told a samurai had built it. Is that true, my lord? We use the bamboo to hone our skill with the sword. It takes focused blade to cut through all of the bamboo in one stroke. Please forgive my ignorance. I put everything back where it belonged, even the flag beside it. I appreciate that, but it would have been all right to repair your wagon. I'll make sure the stand sees use. I mean, why'd you take the flag down? I can understand the bamboo, but why'd you take the flag down? Remember the um, South Park horror episode with uh, the evil alternate universe? And Sharon like kidnaps Officer Barbretti and puts him in the basement? And Randy's like, and she's like, uh, there's a police officer in our basement. She's like, I know. I had to put him there because I was afraid he'd take our baby away. And he's like, Sharon, why'd you take his pants off? Sharon, why'd you take his pants off? Like, she took his pants off and tied him up in the basement. Like, what the hell? Why were his pants off? You know? Like, why'd you take the flag off? Like, it makes no sense. It wasn't necessary. I guess the best you can do is just to prove things as they start um, banning them in chat. I know it's a bit ridiculous at times. There's some things that shouldn't be approved, you know, which are very bad, like harassful things. But most of the stuff is like, fine. Women don't make sense, Kuma. You know this. <laughs> Clearly, I don't. I'm so confused. By what logic did she take his... Ah! Jin. I'm sorry to interrupt. You're not. You've been praying. To my ancestors. Asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. Kill your sister? What do they say? I can't hear them. Oh, that's good. She's not crazy. Perhaps your ancestors are silent because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fort. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. The sister betrayed. How much you want to bet it wasn't Masako, which was the one that was betrayed? There's probably going to be some reveal about what the F happened. How did you find your sister? She was married to a man named Ikeda, a retainer for Clan Kikuchi. Their stronghold is near here, under the mountain. She always wanted an estate and holdings of her own. And with Kikuchi's men fallen at Komoda. It made sense she would try and take Kikuchi's for herself. Especially after she failed to take yours. I asked around. It seems a new clan has taken up residence. Their emblem matches the one on the notes. Then it's her. What a thought! People what say a... she's turned it into a haven for refugees. Claiming she knows what it's like to lose her home. Do you think it's true? We're about to find out. She sounds awful. Why would your sister say she lost her home? She had to leave home when she married Ikeda. You said Ikeda was a retainer? Yes. But you're the younger sister. Why were you the one to marry a samurai? When we were young, bandits attacked our estate. Hana hid with our parents. I took up a sword. Only after I dispatched the bandits did a samurai guard arrive to help. Adachi was leading them. Hana saw him as a way to realize her ambitions, but he only had eyes for me. She was jealous then, the seed of many betrayals. I wanted to ease her heartbreak, so I helped arrange her marriage to Ikeda, and she was sent north. Oof! 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 Did you know the man you sent your sister to live with? Ikeda was a respected widower. People spoke well of his kindness. Kindness Widower? is a mask easily removed behind closed doors. What are you getting at, Jin? I want to understand why she went to such extremes to destroy you. After so many years. There is only one thing to understand. Hana murdered my family. And today, she will pay for it. Well, look at it from her point of view. The younger sister 
got married first, even though traditionally the older is supposed to get married. She got married to the samurai, which the older sister wanted, and then it looks like her younger sister married her off to a widower, a man that was already married up north where she's isolated from the rest of her family. That almost makes you sound like the one that's been conspiring the entire time. I mean, I'm just saying. But at the same time, why is it so shocking that a samurai went for the younger sister? I mean, that's happened a million times. Let's face it. Men are dicks. Don't try to deny it, guys. You know it's true. Samurai like them young. Correction, Japanese men like them young. I mean, that explains the whole schoolgirl thing, doesn't it? I mean, it makes perfect rational sense. This rift started when there were kids, and look how far it went. Jesus Christ. Was there ever any sign of her betrayal? We were never close, but our relationship was always cordial. I would see her at Lord Shimura's conclaves. We'd exchange pleasantries. I had no idea she held such hate in her heart. But she was at your estate, the day of the attack. She came that morning to wait with me for news from Komoda Beach. We were both concerned for our husbands. It was the first time I ever felt close to her. She met my grandchildren, brought them gifts. They loved her. Now I know she hadn't come for comfort, but to witness our death. Wait, so that's the first time the she- women in your family fought. I saw that for myself. I stayed with my son's wives while Hana took the children and ran for the stables. Afterward, I found what I thought was her body. The face was brutalized, unrecognizable. Smart. But the gold sash was Hana's. I buried her with my family. She must have learned you survived the attack. Faked her death to escape you. A clever plan. My survival was her greatest mistake. So if that was the first time she met your grandkids, then she would have had no emotional connection to them, making it easier to do that. God damn, this was a recipe for disaster 40 years in the making. Jesus Christ. Well, this is going to be an interesting mission, that's for sure. Nerves of steel. Hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. Example A. We're almost there. Why did she not just marry her off to Jin? Uh, Leave the horses. We'll continue on foot. If you haven't noticed, Masako is old. This was probably before Jin was even conceived. Like, she's a grandmother. Guards at the gate. Be ready. If this is a haven for survivors. There's no telling what to expect. Earth, Lady Hawk. Uh, I think. Help me open the gate. Quickly, before more guards show up. Did we just kill these guys before asking them the question? Arranged marriage? People have done stranger. But she just found out that her sister's alive. Why was she arranged to marry him with Jin? Because her husband died at Komoda Beach. So she is helping people. Hana helps no one but herself. She's building a village. Why do they run? Lady Hana, show yourself! Yay, let's just Kill announce them. ourselves. Where is she? Reinforcements. You serve a murderer. Fish me, you coward! They're retainers. Which the dojo. How many are there? Doesn't matter. Kill them all. Well, she's definitely got a warrior's heart. I'll give her that. I mean, if she was the younger sister, and she was skilled with a blade, hell, even I would have went for her. This guy refuses to die. 
I've had enough! Kill them and let's be done with it! Damn it. This thing says there's something here. I wanna grab it real quick. Where is it? Guide me fly! Is it up? Is there an up? Where are you guiding me? Hmm? I see it! What the fuck? That is like on the other side of the building. Bingo. And now I change into my ghost gear. So you're part of the problem, Kuma. Why? Because I married people that I'm attracted to? What's this? Please, don't kill me. Wait, is that her? Why is it calling her a peasant then? Why don't we just call her a mongrel and be done with it? Where's Lady Hana? In the estate up the hill, my lord. Tell the coward her sister has come. I mean, I could sing a Devil May Cry song, but I'm not gonna. All what right, I'm not. What do when you see her? Exactly what she did to me. She's still your family. My family is dead. She is nothing but a murderer. Okay, well, let's see how this goes. And if I see your husband up there, who was supposed to be at Komoda Beach, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill him myself. Hana, show yourself. Little sister, you let me think I buried you. Who was it, really? A peasant woman killed by the Mongols. Did you weep for me? You have taken everything! Daughters and grandchildren. Not nearly enough. The Mongols robbed me of Adachi's death. And you cheated yours. But finally, I will take everything. Kill oh. Oh yeah, she sounds like a thought. She just sounds greedy at this point. Stop her. I will deal with them. Thank you. If she said something like, "Oh, you took, you ruined my life or some shit," you ruined my ghost mode. I would let him. God damn it, why do I suck at jogging? Why do I suck at dodging? I'm like Gohan! Don't kill her too quickly! Hmm? You murdered my children. My grandchildren. Destroyed my family. A small price to pay for what you've done. I have done nothing. You stole everything. Drove me from our home. There it is. Took the life that was rightfully mine. Told ya. Left me with that abusive drunk in this frozen land. There it is. You would have to suffer an eternity of pain to understand the life I've lived. The life you forced on me! None of that is my fault. It is! And damn you for acting as if it isn't! You've come to kill me! So finish this! It will be your only kindness! I can't end your suffering. But you can. Now! You have nothing! That's kind of sad. If you think about it, 
She was young when she was married off to a drunk. My family. I've tried to honor them. Meditate on treasured memories. But she consumes them. Even now. I have nothing about them. No. You've accomplished what you set out to do. You have honored your family, given them justice. Now you can find peace. This path does not lead to peace. Where does it lead? I don't know. I have to continue walking it to find out. I don't want you to go. I must. But I will be there when you need me. That is so fucking sad. Worn by Samurai Vodachi Clan. Charm of Lost Mind, Stealth Charm. When you realize this all started when her family got attacked and she caught the eye of the samurai. I mean. With how things were in the beginning, her, her big sister didn't really do anything so bad. She hid with her mother because she was afraid. She was a child. Yeah, Masako was brave and she could fight bandits. But, you know, the sister was a girl that was scared. I get she would have been jealous that she married the samurai that you would think the elder sister would get. But the real tipping point was when Masako convinced her to marry the other guy who ended up being a horrible husband. Had the other guy actually been a good husband, things would have been very different. But she grew very venomous after years and years of abuse from a drunk. And it wouldn't surprise me if the guy was physically abusive too. And what was she going to do? Leave and be a widow in Japanese culture? No one would want her. In that time, if you were like 25, 30 and not married as a woman... You were seen as a leftover girl. And no one would want you. They'd say there's something wrong with you. So it's really fucked up. What's what is she wasn't even aware that she sent her own sister to live in hell. She wasn't. She thinks she did nothing wrong. And there was no communication with her sister. So this would have been happening for years. Years and years of poison just building up. That's the real sad story. I don't know, what can I say? These stories are not happy endings. It's such a shame, neither of them got anything good in the end. The elder sister wanted revenge, but she didn't get happiness out of it. She died miserable. The younger sister lost her entire family. Imagine that, losing your husband, losing your children, and then losing your grandchildren to your sister. And then losing your sister too. Your whole family lineage gone. I mean, fuck. End of a bloodline, exactly. All, all because of something... Ishikawa's one is that he doesn't have an heir. 
Masako's one is that she's lost her entire family and bloodline. Noiri, he lost his brother who was his family. And he pretty much lost his way and his fate. All these fucking stories are about loss. Even Ryuzo is loss. Is there a fucking happy story in this whole thing? I think she's too old to have a child. Kill three enemies with a chain assassination. Kenji? I mean, Kenji's story was somewhat nice. Even, um... Wear warm clothes next time. You guys look cold. All oh, right, chain assassination. Man, people in this world are having a shitty time. <laughs> oh, still haven't taken it back. You seem to forget, sure, that both men and women prefer the mold. Alright, where's the other guys? Alright, we can still do our chain assassination. It's biologically not possible to have kids anymore. At least she looks older than 40, 50. Yeah, she's 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 like old, old. She's a grandmother. 50, 60 sort of thing. That's why she said she's lost everything. I want one more? No. Ah, shit. Plus, she's too broken. You think she can form another emotional connection? Come here and fight! I'm sorry, horse. If only one child survived. Well, it seems that Jin is, you know, without a father and without a family, but he's the heir to so many. Pff, fuck, man. He's like the heir to all the samurai on this goddamn island. What are you supposed to do with that? Well, this was, this was a very, um, interesting stream. 
This was a shocking stream, actually. The two storylines that we completed were just tragic. For very different reasons. Well, they did not, and yes, yeah, Spiritual Jin is a godchild to half of these. I mean, he is, but shit, these stories were dark. But, I mean, that's what they are. Stories. Let's try uh, not to do that. Salmon? Salmon. What's salmon? Light noodle. So we're not getting people. Then I will walk to KFC and get the fried chicken wings. I do, but I can get the fried chicken wings. We can have both. Well, you heard that. I have to go get some fried chicken. We'll do the main story next stream. Uh, because let me take a look at the tales of Tsushima. What do we have left? We don't have any of our side missions left. So we can do the main story. The side stories are nice, but I don't believe they will go away by completing the main story. Those feel like something that will stay after we complete the main story. At this point, Jin is the heir to the samurai, heir to the Adachis to continue their legacy, the heir to the way of the bow and Ishikawa's teaching, the heir to the way of the ghost, and also the way of the flame. He's also um, the heir to the cursed um, bow. He's also the heir to Gosaku's armor. Like, what the fuck isn't he an heir of? He's an heir of the straw hats, because he's basically going to be the last surviving one that knows their ways, who's defeated their leader. I mean... Th this whole story has been about loss. Isn't he the first ghost? I mean, you would think so. It's going to be interesting, to say the least. I don't think it, the story is going to have a happy ending. I sincerely hope that Yuna doesn't die, because I think she's had a pretty rough ride as it is, losing her brother. It would be nice, at the very least, for Jin not to lose fucking literally everybody. And it would be nice for him to have a love interest, at the very least. I don't know how things are going to end with his uncle. I don't think his uncle will accept Jin out of sheer pride. Simple as that. The guy's too stubborn and too proud. So, he's not going to accept Jin. Well, Jin's not going to let himself get arrested again, because fuck that shit. You know, it didn't work the first time, and I don't think they're just going to hold him the second time. So you've got these two very opposed forces, but at the end of the day, they're family. But it's not going to end well. I know, we're, I know we're gunning for the Khan. In best case scenario, both Shimura and Jin are attacking the Khan at the same time. And I get the feeling that maybe Shimura is going to challenge the Khan. Because he wants to be an honorable bastard, but he's going to lose. The Khan's going to fucking kick his ass. And it might come down to Jin saving his uncle by fighting the Khan or assassinating the Khan or something like that. And then out of some stupid pride, Shimura's like, I would have rather died a warrior than live, you know, a coward or some shit. Which again, is stupid. And then Jin just, you know, goes on his merry way. That would be the best scenario. That would be the closest thing to a happy ending there could be. Or you can have a completely bad one. Same scenario, except Shimura's basically dead. With no heir himself. But can't accept Jin because he's the ghost. So, boom. You know, Shimura clan's dead. And Jin kills the Khan. Or worst case scenario, the Khan doesn't even fucking die. He escapes the island. Or is off to the mainland. And you've got Shimura and Jin basically stuck there. Like... I don't see it being happy. The happiest thing we can get out of this story is if Yuna lives and Jin, at the very least, has a love interest. Is Shimura going to survive? We don't know. Is Yuna going to survive? We don't know. Is the Khans going to survive? We don't know. At this point, anyone can be on the chopping block. I don't think the game needs to kill anyone for sheer shock value, but if they do do it, it's going to be done for emotional impact. It's just... 
Uh, either way, next stream is probably going to be the finale to the story, so I hope you're going to be there. Because it's going to be fucking great. I certainly hope they don't kill Jin. Or Jin sacrifices himself or something like that, because that would just be really sad. Because he's had an incredibly rough run. <sighs> the next stream is next Monday. So basically seven days from now. Friday's, of course, going to be the Warcraft lore stream. Saturday's going to be Persona 5 Royale. Sunday's going to be whatever wins the vote. The Council of Kumas, which are the subscribers and sponsors, are currently voting. If you haven't voted, head over to the Discord. Council of Kuma thread. You just hook up your Discord to your Patreon or your Twitch, and you should get the role on Discord, and then you can go and vote. This is going to be interesting. I'm really heavily invested in the story. We've lost so many people already that it's fucked up. I hope we don't lose more. Yeah, this is this is going to be a good one. This is going to be a good one. We're on that final stretch where it can literally go anywhere. This is going to be a good one. I'm looking forward to it. I hope to see you there. Thank you for watching. Oh my god, we're on 77,773 views. It would have been funny if that was 77777. But anyways... Make sure you're following if you're on Twitch and you're not following already. If you're on YouTube, make sure you subscribe. And I'm going to see you guys there at the live stream. Looking forward to it. I'll catch you on Discord during the week. That's where I hang out. That's where we hang out. That's where we chill. Yeah, I, I can't wait till next week. What's this song? Thank God it's not the sad song. I'm going to go listen to some OSTs while I'm going to get dinner for Hachon. She's cooking at home. I'm going to go get some fried chicken. So thanks for coming, guys. Ghost! 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 Ghost!